My novel is close to us as breathing is set in a real place, Woodmont, Connecticut, a small shoreline borough of Milford, Connecticut. Though the characters and events of the novel are fictional, Woodmont is a place loaded with family history, and it's the only place on earth where all four sides of my extended family, the physical and emotional DNA of my very being, intersect. With that astonishing depth of connection in mind, I dedicated the book to the family, Matskin, Madnik, Pashalinsky, Poliner, the living members of which surely hold Woodmont memories. I also dedicated the novel to my parents, one from Middletown, Connecticut, the other, that one in the back, <laughs> from Waterbury, Connecticut. They met as teenagers in Woodmont, their families traveling there for summer vacations, part of the crowd of Connecticut Jews who's funneled down to Woodmont and within Woodmont to the Jewish section, affectionately known then as Bagel Beach. Indeed, if it weren't for Woodmont and a little bit of it called Bagel Beach, I wouldn't exist. I grew up hearing about Bagel Beach and my parents' summers there as kids. My mother's nuclear family rented a cottage in the messy cluster of cottages lining the Bagel Beach shore that I describe in the book. Many times my mother has described for me the evening crowd at nearby Anchor Beach and the teenage flirting she did there. Each evening on the way to the anchor, she'd wave at her grandparents, one of the many elders invariably rocking on the porch chairs of Parsky's Hotel, their Woodmont home year after year.